All right, people, it's Sprat here, and today I want to talk to you guys about sniping. Sniping as a whole, sniping on multiple first-person shooter games. So I'm talking about Call of Duty, Battlefield, Destiny, Halo, and a bit of CSGO, because if you follow me on Twitter, I've been trying CSGO on the PC a little bit, uh, trying to get into it. I'm, you know, I'm not the best, but I'm, you know, I'm slowly getting there. I've never been a mouse and keyboard kind of guy because I've never had uh, shooter games on the PC, but now I'm getting into it. I'm, I'm getting there. I'm slowly getting there. I'm improving. But um, before we get into today's video, be sure to check out all my partners in the description below, and you can use code Sprat on checkout for a little bit of a discount. I just want to talk to you guys about Sniper as a whole because I play it. You know, I'm branching out now. I'm branching out to all these different shooters, and um, you know. It's, uh, I mean, even Gears of War, I used to play Gears of War loads in the past, and I'm thinking about doing like a look back video on Gears of War because I've actually found one of my old, old montages where it's actually a dual charge from like 2009, 2010, I think. So if you want to see that, let me know because I'd love to do a video on that. But overall, I want to talk to you guys about sniping on these games. You know, there's so many different games that are, that are out there that I'm playing at the moment. And uh, sniping is just different on every single one of them. I want to talk to you guys about that and get your opinions on it. So if you have any thoughts on this, remember to leave a comment. It would be awesome to get a discussion going. So I want to talk to you guys about the sniper and whether it should be a one shot to the chest or above. Um, or the waste or above. I don't know really what it is on Call of Duty. You, you kind of just don't get that many hit markers on Call of Duty, let's be honest. So, uh, whether it should be that or whether it should be like these games where it's a one shot to the head, unless you've got like a certain attachment on, which is just like Battlefield, you can get like certain snipers which are a one shot to the body at certain ranges. And uh, there's a lot of things that go into Battlefield uh, for, to make it a one shot. Where there's Destiny, there's Halo, where it's only a one shot to the head. You can't get a sniper. I'm pretty sure you can't get a sniper on Halo that's not a, you know, that's a one shot to the body. And and then on Gears of War, that's another one as well. One shot to the head, unless you get like an active, which I, I haven't actually played the new Gears of Wars. So, actually, did I play? I think I played the newest one and then I didn't touch it after because it was terrible. But you know, in the past, it's always been one shot to the head. Uh, and then with CSGO, I, th I think it's one shot to the body. Um, you know, waist or above. That game is ridiculously hard anyway, so... That's kind of like an exception on what I was going to talk about because I was going to say that there's two types of gamers, two types of games. There's the casual game, which is Call of Duty, and we can't deny it. Casual games like Call of Duty, you can just pick it up. Any person can pick it up and could probably go positive, could probably have a good game. Whatever class they use, they have tailored Call of Duty to be a casual game for casual gamers. You know, simple as that. Apart, I mean, I feel like Advanced Warfare is a lot different. I don't know if it's maybe the opponents I'm coming up against. But I feel like with the movement and everything, that game is not for the casual gamer at all. But I don't know, maybe I'm wrong there. But that for me is is why sniping is a one shot and should be a one shot. I mean, it's, you know, anyone can do any class, anybody can use any gun and they should do okay with it. It seems to be the exception. You know, we've got all these games out there. They're all one shot to the head and Call of Duty is different. It's not about being realistic because, you know, games aren't realistic at all. Let's be honest. Games are just far from it. There's so many different things when it comes to video games that aren't realistic and, and people who bring the realism factor into like an argument of whether a game's good or not, it's just, it's just dumb because they're not at all, you know, not even close to it. Uh, if you were using a pistol and you shot a guy in the head, he'd die. You know, he'd, he'd, be, he'd be dead in one shot. I think CSGO, to be honest with you, is one of the most realistic ones regarding, uh, you know, guns and recoils and power and health and all that. It's It really is weird because I've never played a game like that. So um, that's nice to play, nice change of pace. You know, that's kind of like the outlier here. Just with games like, you know, Battlefield, Halo, Destiny, Gears of War, all those games that are one shot, only one shot to the head with a sniper. And apart from on Battlefield where... There's certain snipers, certain attachments that you can use to make it one shot a certain rage. And, and that's why I wanted to make this commentary, actually, is because people have been, you know, I've, I've seen people on my Battlefield videos, on my um, Destiny videos that ask it, oh, is there a one shot sniper? Is there, or is there a sniper that's the one shot from the waist or above? I think that's because of, of, you know, Call of Duty, of how we've been introduced into this, you know, casual play style where all these other games, if you hop on, and have never played the game before, you're probably not going to do that well, unless you're pretty good at games, then you'd probably be fine. But you know, with Call of Duty, anybody can hop on and do well, and that's how it's always been, and probably always will be. So people have been asking me, like, oh, why don't you try this sniper on Battlefield as a sniper, like 300 knockout, like dot .300 knockout, or something like that. And it's a one shot to, you know, to the chest or whatever from like a certain range. And people are like, oh, why don't you unlock that and then use that? Because I was I was just failing when I was live streaming and I just couldn't get headshots. It really is kind of tough uh, to get used to. I just destroyed on the beta and on this, when the game actually dropped, I just can't hit people in the head. I'm just struggling. I don't know what it did to change it, but it's definitely a lot different. So people are like, why do you get the sniper? It's a one shot. Why don't you do this? It's a one shot. And I'm just thinking, well... 
it's a different game. It's not Call of Duty. I don't want to play it like it's Call of Duty. I want to play it like it how it is. You know, it's it's a different game. It's it's Battlefield. It's Destiny. You don't play it like Call of Duty because you can't because it's totally different games. So when people keep saying to me, you know, why do you use this one shot sniper? I just want to think. I just want to say, well, I don't want to because it's. It, I feel like that's not how I used to play the game. What do you guys think? Do you think I'm being you know ignorant about it? I don't know because. Uh, in my eyes, you know, Call of Duty is just so different from every other game. It's just so casual compared to these games. You know, if you're watching this footage right now, this Destiny or, or Battlefield or whatever I've got in the background, you can see, like, it's pretty intense. Uh, it's pretty hard to stay alive and do well without getting shut down because it's so... I don't know, it's just so different. With Call of Duty, you can just run around and destroy and keep destroying. It's so easy, it's so simple, just run around, get streaks together, whatever. On these games, if unless you're playing idiots, you know, you're not going to do that kind of stuff. So when people say, oh, why don't you just do this to make it easy for you? And I'm just like, well, that's Call of Duty. You know, that's just how it is on that game. It's not the same on this game. So I don't want to play it like it's that game. So yeah, I'm probably rambled on a little bit here, but I just wanted to talk to you guys about, you know, sniping as a whole, how it's different on every game, and whether you think it should be like it is on Call of Duty on every game or like it is on, you know, these other games. And I still love sniping. You know, it's still probably one of my favorite things to do on any game. I just... I just love the idea of it, I love the concept of it, it's a challenge for me and I don't want to you know, toot my own horn here but you know, red gunning as a whole is just pretty simple, pretty easy for me um, because I've just played so many games, I'm just kind of skilled in that area, I mean you know you got to be good at something right and I'm, I'm pretty good at video games but that's why I snipe, you know I like the challenge, I like to do something a little bit, it's not different now, you know it was years ago, different but uh, you know the population of, of people making videos and, and sniping and stuff, it's obviously grown but the idea of it is still fun to me and I still like a challenge so that's why I do it you know and that's why I want to talk about it in this video today so hopefully you enjoyed this commentary I know it's a bit all over the place but I'm a bit rusty you know I haven't really made many commentaries in a while uh, but I just thought of this last night I don't know if you guys are the same but when you're laying in bed and I'm trying to sleep I kind of come up with ideas of commentaries and videos and all that stuff so I had this last night I just thought yeah let's talk about it see what people think see what you guys think I know it's probably gonna be a little bit biased towards Call of Duty and um, people are like yeah what want it to be one shot it's a lot more fun I could agree with that but then there's a certain challenge and that's what I was talking about earlier with the two type of gamers whether they want it easy or whether they want a challenge so a bit all over the place here well hope you enjoyed and yeah like I said let me know in the comments what you think leave a like if you enjoyed thank you guys for watching and I'll see you guys soon peace